In this video, I will show you how you can link up your ZK Teco IP cameras to your computer without using an NVR. So here are the various parts that we'll be using in this demonstrational video. Of course, we have two ZK Teco IP cameras here. We'll be using just one of them for the demonstration. I have connecting cables, CAT6 network cables fitted with RJ45 for the connections. And then also we have a router here, a network router. It does not have internet on it because we don't need internet in this demonstration. And then as well, I have a PoE switch, which I will also be using. And finally, I have a computer here to which we'll be linking the camera. All right. So we'll start with the camera. So I'll start by connecting it to the network switch and so i'll plug up my network cable into it and then connect into the network switch this way the switch is a poe switch and then the camera is a poe camera so this single connection is enough to be able to both power it up and then also transmit the video coming from the camera into the network switch I will now link the network switch to the router so that the video that is coming from the camera which comes into the network switch can now be transferred into the router as well. So with my network cable, I'll plug from the uplink port of the network switch and take it into a LAN port on the router. This connection now means that the video from this camera which is connected to the network switch has now been transferred from the network switch into the router. So the video will now be available on the router. And so now I can connect my computer to the router so that the computer can also have access to the video that is on this particular camera now. So with the help of another network cable, I will connect my computer to the router this connection now means that the camera is connected to the network switch and the output of the network switch is connected to the router and the computer is also connected to that same router to which the camera is connected so the computer and the camera can now easily communicate so on the computer we would have to look for the ip address of the ip camera that we have connected to the network that we want to assess so we'll have to enter the ip address of the router which is normally 192.168.0.1 it could be dot .0 0.1 depending on your your router so when you enter it will present you with the login interface of your router. So I will enter the username and password of my router here. And then I will log into the router. Now in the router, I'm just looking for the IP address of the camera. So I'll get down to the connected devices and I can see connected clients. There are two clients connected here. I suspect is my computer and the network camera. So when I click at the connected clients, it presents me with the two IP addresses or the IP addresses of the devices connected to the router. The first IP address is for my my PC and the second IP address is the IP address for the IP camera which I am looking for and the IP address here is 192.168.0.89 so this is the IP address we will put into another browser to be able to locate the IP camera so we can just load another web page and enter that IP address 192 dot one six eight dot zero dot eighty nine and when we hit enter it presents us with the login interface of the ip camera 
the username of the IP camera is still the admin since it's the default username and password that is still on it. And then the password is one, two, three, four, five, six. And then I'll just log into the IP camera. And it now gives us a live picture of the IP camera. And this is exactly what we are trying to look for. And so it's a very simple process. If you are able to go through this, you'll be able to view your ZK Teco IP camera live on your computer. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please ensure you subscribe to the channel and also turn on the notification so you can always be notified anytime we come up with new videos like this. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.